right unusually I seem to have some time on my hands. It is a bit unusual actually, so I've got quite a bit of time on my hands. Um, so we'll carry on with the list. Someone just set fire to themselves outside the houses of Parliament. I can only guess, really, reasons why, can't we? Driven to fucking desperation, probably, by certain elements of the authorities. I would imagine. I'm a police officer. We're off to a good start. Cleveland Police. Misconduct. Sacked. PC Mandeep Upal. West Midlands Police. Charged with four rapes. Proceeding. We're still in 2013, by the way. Uh, PC Ruri Stewart, Gloucestershire Police, driving without due care, fined £2,771. A strange amount. How bizarre. I wonder how they came to that. They must have done something pretty serious. Uh, PC Sugra Hanif. West Midlands Police, charge of misconduct, proceeding. Sergeant Richard Miller, Greater Manchester, common assault, fined £500. You get almost twice that if you, um, if you assault a police officer, you know. Well, defend yourself. Um, DCI April Casburn, Metropolitan Police, selling info to the news of the world. <laughs> Jailed for 15 months. There seems to be a lot of that going on, the last couple of ones we've done in there. Hmm. Must have been interesting times in 2013. Uh, David McClucky. Yeah, I, d I didn't just make that up, it does, that is his name. Chief Chair of Police Authority, perverting the course of justice, jailed for eight months. Now, he'd be a civilian. There is something called the Police Authority Board in Cambridge or something similar, I think, and that it's just a bunch of people having meetings. So I can't imagine what he actually did. A police officer, Metropolitan Police, charged with five counts of rape proceeding. Ivan Essack, Kent Police, murdered his wife. Jailed for 28 years. That's the second one, isn't it? I'm sure there was another one who murdered his wife quite a while ago. Uh, Detective Gary Quigley, Metropolitan Police, administering poison. Fuck. Awaiting sentence. It wasn't a made-up Novichok attack, was it? That was that. That was after 2013, I think. PC Stephen Holt, Metropolitan Police, housing benefit fraud. 200 hours community service. Why? Presumably, I don't know, presumably he was on housing benefit, he'd got into the police and not stopped claiming it. I'm, I presume. Oh, DS, Jason Robinson and George Nevins. I'm finally planning ahead. Both the Cumbria police, both data protection offences, both not guilty. A likely fucking story. Uh, PC Russell Tui, Bedfordshire Police, kissed a 15-year-old, 18 months suspended. Of course, you knew the judge, obviously. PC Colin Crompton, Humberside Police, punching a teenager. 12 months community order. Fuck. No one else would go down for that, would the Adult punching a teenager, you know. Doesn't say punching another man, so I'm presuming under 18. Uh, Inspector Damon Johnston, Northamptonshire, posted pic of genitals on Facebook. <laughs> Inspector! Not a fucking police constable or a PCSO. I just post a picture of my dick on Facebook. What can possibly go wrong? Probably had it on worldwide setting or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. 
So how did Chris, Chris O'Leary, Sussex Police? Oh, hang on, there's a load of... Uh, oh, they were all cleared. All charged with assault, all cleared. So if anyone knows any of these names, let us know the inside story about you. Sergeant Chris O'Leary, PC Lucy Finney, PC Natalie Jennings, PC Jacqueline Peel. A lot of women. Not that I wish to say that women cannot assault people, but... PC Oliver Pullen. Right, all Sussex, all charged with assault, all cleared. I don't believe a fucking word of it. Seriously. Um... PC Gary Donnelly, North Wales Police, indecent assault, attempted rape, jailed for 18 months. PC Paul Baker, Metropolitan Police, misconduct, jailed for 8 months. PC Christopher Little, Durham Police, indecent images of children, 3 year community order. Oh, fuck. I did actually know someone I was at school with. Because I still go home to see my parents now and again. Um, and he got done for, I think it was, was it when they called making up images or something like that? Um, and he went, he went down. And it was for some months as well. So why all these coppers are getting community service and community orders, I don't know. Well, other than they know the judge. Uh, five officers, Metropolitan Police, playing, playing poker whilst on duty. Oh, five sides. <laughs> Dear. That's that lack of resources, isn't it? <laughs> We're all sitting around a poker table, <laughs> fucking cigars in their mouths. <laughs> Little shots of whiskey. <laughs> Michael Feller. Guernsey Police, importing drugs, money laundering, jailed for eight years. What a stand-up bunch of people these guys are, aren't they? Jesus Christ. Right, we'll see you later.